Hey guys, Rush here with another cool video. Today I have another cool invention for you, an invention that I actually came up with, or at least I was the first one to come up with this. But it's pretty cool, and I'll uh, show it to you really quick, so let's get to it. So, I have this button here, as you can probably see right here. And this button, if I push this button, it doesn't really, it doesn't really do anything here. But, if I'll do something here and you'll see if you can figure out what happened or if you see any change so see anything no let's try it again this time though I'll stand right about here okay And voila, uh, this is secret room filled with a whole bunch of torches. So let me just no clip out of here and show you this again before I actually get to how it works. But you can see this button blends in, right? But if I just push it once, as you can see, it doesn't, it doesn't set off this. I can push it three times, but again, it won't set off. Now, if I I could push it like maybe four times, but if I could kind of like have a little bit of a delay in between each click, and again, it still doesn't get set off. But if I go kind of fast like this you can see that it should set off like that now what I made here is I'll actually show you all the wiring is this back here it's um, it's not that hard to make basically what happens is when I here I'll give you a, a small example if I click this right here fly up you can see it activates that piston right so if I click this twice can see see it when this piston gets activated and I click it again the piston will send the charge to these redstone repeaters then it will set off this piston and then that's where the other click come in comes in and the um, charge gets sent to these redstone repeaters and it will eventually turn on this piston which will kind of toggle itself really fast which will get into a secret room so I'll show this to you again can see that happening and then it's all about timing see and then it gets sent to this this piston and then it will activate uh, that part right there so this is the invention um, it's I haven't come up with a name for it but I'll think about it and put it in the description if you want to check that out but um, it's all about timing so if you just like miss it by one click if you just miss by one click maybe one second then the whole thing will not activate and it it's pretty good I mean you can just click on it people will look around see nothing happens and they'll probably walk away but if you have like a secret layer and you tell it to like a group of people that you only want getting into the secret room then they will know the code and then you can set it to whatever you want by just delaying the redstone repeaters so, as you can see right there, I just clicked it and it didn't set it off because I must have missed it. But yeah, if you want to make a code different, then all you get got to do is just delay some of these redstone repeaters or make them a little bit longer and then all that stuff. So, that's basically it. This dip right here, um, what that does is it just, it's, it lets this flow, but once, when the redstone or the piston pushes out the stone, it will cut this off and it will send the charge to this and again it will happen to this piston and then I click it again it sends a charge to this and into this piston right here this face right here as you can see I stand right under this piece of gray wool that's just an indicator on where to stand so that is my new invention for day today 
I hope you like this video. Uh, be sure to check out my other videos and to subscribe. I'll see you guys later.